Mabuhai, this is Bob from Love Beyond the Sea. Today I wanted to talk about a milestone, I think, for my wife, maybe for your Filipina wife as well, and that would be being able to vote. We just had the Nebraska 2022 primary election. I think it was yesterday or the day before. And this was the first time my wife was able to vote. Now, she got here in 2016. I would say 2021 is when she became a citizen. And, um, and then her first opportunity to vote um, and get exposure to that was um, this week. So I'm, I'm very proud of her. It's a, it's a feather in her cap to be able to vote. A lot of Filipinas, and not just Filipinas, women from other nationalities, um, are not in a hurry to even become citizens. We, we knew an Australian woman that had been here over 20 years and had not become a citizen. Uh, another Filipina that had been here over 20 years had not become a citizen, but when she heard we were going, uh, she wanted to come with us and get her citizenship, so now they can vote too. I don't know uh, how important it is to them, but I'm, I'm glad she is. And um, so I think it's a big deal. And let me know if your wife um, is eager to vote and if you talk to her about these things, if she asks you questions about it, if she follows the news, uh, now that your Philippine has been in your country for a while, you know, is she talking about wanting to vote? Um, I think it's a big deal because now my wife can have a voice in issues and in uh, the uh, races of uh, uh, the elections that come up in the future and uh, other things that vote on once in a while, like, you know, whether to allow gambling, for example, she'll be able to have a voice in that. So I think that's exciting. I mean, I'll never be able to be a citizen in, in another country and be able to, to vote. I think it's important. You know, when I was younger, I probably didn't vote until I was uh, about 40 years old. <clears throat> uh, shameful, I know. So my wife is younger in that, than that, and she is voting for the first time. Now, we do need to be more prepared. It kind of sneaks up on you. And so we need to be ready next time. And when she told them this was her first time, they gave her an ovation. They applauded her over there at the um, election polling place. So um, that was a, a big moment for my love beyond the sea.